In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get some massive free packs on FC24. Every year, the new game has a bunch of milestone objectives that can get you some big packs, usually 100k packs, but this year, we have a few more than usual. And there's been some changes. So this year, you only need to score 250 goals for the 100k pack in Finishing Mastery, where it was 500 goals last year, so it's been halved. In Assist Mastery, it's not quite as generous. It's now 400 assists. I haven't even done it for this video just because I couldn't be bothered to go ahead and get another like 160 assists but we have done the the goals one another new one for 100k pack is the league mastery again i haven't done it but you can go and do it so it's play 10 games with wsl team at uh, four of them in your team at uh, league and four of them in your team mls wmls and then french division one feminine and premier league so there's one two three four five six that you can do you can have four in a team each time so you can actually get it done by playing a total of 60 games it sounds like a lot but if you do it with a friend and they just back out after one nil it's actually really quick and easy another one that's relatively passive is evolutions mastery now this one you're not going to go and do straight away but you'll do it over time you'll gradually unlock this whilst you do evolution in the game and at some point i would say in december you'll get 100k pack be like oh nice i forgot about that another new one is moments mastery now this is in the moments section it's actually really easy it might seem a bit daunting because you have to do one of them on ultimate and legendary difficulty but effectively you get a 1v1 it's the exact same scenario every single time there's four per group and six groups so you effectively have to do it 24 times and you get a 100k pack for this as well which we have completed i'm going to press l3 and get all of the packs at the same time which is actually really good i'm a big fan of this feature ea thank you very very much and of course you can go through and see a bunch of other easy packs you can get time is money they are free it just you have to invest some time nothing in this world is necessarily free but they are technically free so we've got a bunch of packs to open here because i've gone ahead and grinded for a while to get these i've been doing this it took me about two and a bit hours to get i think we've got a total of two 100k packs and 85 double we, oh, we've had some good packs here so player pick oh okay that's actually not a great player pick at all is it we got ourselves diego carlos who is a duplicate and tradable. Great, I'm glad I took him. That was smart. All right, so for a total of just over two hours, I've accumulated quite a few decent packs. We've got two 100k packs, a rare mega pack, a couple of two players pack, an 85 times two, which is obviously only available if you have the game early from the Nike Mad Ready objective, an 81 double, 281 double, should I say. And then we have some like smaller packs like premium goals, jumper premium gold. These ones are actually just really nice for filling up the club with uh, consumables and things like that. You know, you want to get uh, contracts, you want to get... I was going to say position modifiers, but they're obviously not in the game anymore. But they are really good for just filling up the club and sort of club maintenance, which is always really helpful. And uh, if you're running an RTG, it's nice to get these kind of packs every once in a while just to keep the club healthy and running. You know what I mean? Just just makes life a lot easier. Um, that being said, we are obviously going to open up the rest of these packs and see what we get. I love this feature where you can just swap everything and find out what's tradable, what's not tradable. That makes life so much easier. I do feel like this year with the claim all and that sort of stuff, we've got a few really nice quality of life updates. So this is a premium gold play is back right what is this almiron newcastle legend almiron yeah miguel almiron we'll go ahead and swap those over and see if any of them are tradable ea you want to be nice to us two players pack now we've got ourselves a silver in this don't be fooled it's not an icon it's going to be a silver english cv from southampton who's this i don't know this is this is oh harwood bellis taylor harwood bellis i didn't realize oh i did realize but i didn't realize until late that he'd moved to southampton he was actually really good for Burnley last year in the championship he was actually really solid him and bayer were a good Good partnership when Harwood Bellis was not injured. Um, we've got another two-player pack now. This is a two-rare gold upgrade this time. Go on, be Bernardo Silva. Why not? I'll take a Bernardo from a two-rare gold player pack. It is Bernardo as well. Very nice. Okay. Cheeky 88 Bernardo Silva from a two-rare gold player pack. Very, very nice indeed. Thank you very much, EA. And he's uh, an untradeable in the club. That's nice. I've already done De Bruyne's SPC, so he won't be used for that. But it's still a good one to get. All right, we've got an 80 plus double upgrade now as well. What have we got from this? Bernardo's a great pull. Spanish CB. Laporte? No, it's going to be Pau Torres. I want to say 83, but I'm not 100%. Yeah, 83. I think he's a dupe untradeable as well. So I'm just going to discard him straight off the bat. I don't really care about Pau Torres. All right. Two 81 doubles we have got. Then we've got, obviously, the big boy packs. Now, I do have a little special... A uh, bit of content at the end. I've, I have saved my 83 plus times 10 for this video as well. Just some extra content for you guys. Because I'm just a nice guy like that. You know, I'm just nice. Um, so I've got my 80, my 83 times 10 as well from objectives. Because we gained a lot of XP from doing these objectives and getting the 100k packs. We were able to go and get the 83 by 10 from seasonal milestones. Uh, Lobotka, 84 rated. Is he tradable? He is not, sadly. I know Ericsson's not. I've packed him about 40 times. 
Um, we have some big packs here, though. I'm really hoping from that 85 times 2. I'm hoping I can get my first double walkout on FC24. As I haven't got one yet, I'm still chasing it. But I really hope it's possible to get our first double walkout of FC24 in that pack. And I'm aware that I've got like a bit of hair that sticks out. I apologize. It looks stupid. I'm sorry. Um, let's see if any of these are tradable. Get a few coins in the, uh, in the old account. Go on. We don't really need more coins. We've got like over a million coins. But, you know, I'm being greedy. So who cares? Are these tradable EA? All right, here we go. We have two 100k packs real quick. First 100k pack, here we go. I've still not packed an icon or a mad ready player, you know? So either of those would be very nice. There's the Laporte I was looking for. 85 in a 100k pack is not a great start. You really want to walk out so you can get some good danglers. Um, wow, that's a bad 100k pack. That is a very, very bad 100k pack. Okay, not ideal. Yikes. Okay, that wasn't great, but... We have another 100k pack to go. What I like about double walkouts is the lower rated card shows first as well. So if you got like a Nike Mad Ready card and someone else, the lower rated card would show first. Who is a Spanish DM from Atletico? 84 Coke from a... Oh man, okay. Well, this looks like it might be two hours down the drain. I can't lie. I would still advise... We're getting informed. I'd still advise doing the objective if you, if you have time. Um, I would advise it just to the simple fact that... You are going to get some free players in the club. Like, I've got an inform. He's worth about 10k. Jordi Alba might be worth a little bit as well. Um, so, we'll go ahead and sell him. Balde might be worth a bit if he's tradable. So, we'll sell him. Like, you get you get a few coins here and there. I know Joe Gomez is selling for a little bit as well uh, at the start of the game. So, we'll sell him as well. He's probably worth a, a nice, pretty penny as well. So, I do think it's worth... Um, I think it's worth it to most people to do the objectives. It's a couple hours of your time to get some good packs, but I can't lie. Don't expect anything spectacular because sometimes packs don't pay out. Sometimes they don't. 85 times two now. Can we get our first double walkout? I've seen two of these open so far. Both had double walkouts. Knowing my luck, I'll get an 85. Here we go. Who are we going to get? Lavelle? I think that's Lavelle. So there is potential. I don't think we got a double walkout, did we? No, we didn't. We got ourselves one walkout, sadly. I knew my luck would be the only person not to get a double walkout. It is Lavelle, 87 rated. It's good fodder, I guess, for a free pack. What else is in there? Bono. All right, okay. Um, yeah, no, not, not particularly amazing. Not a terrible card, to be fair, but not a particularly uh, enchanting 85 double upgrade. Let me go get my 83 times 10 and see if it's better. All right, we've got my 83 times 10. I also opened some objective packs earlier, and I'll show you them in this video. We had some insane looking those, to be fair. So you'll see those in a minute. 83 times 10. Here we go. Come on, EA. Please. Please. Give me a double walkout, please. Muziala? Oh, Muziala would be class. It's not Muziala. That might be a double, though. I see, like, a shadow behind. It is a double. Who have we got? Oh, Morgan as well. Okay. All right. We got ourselves... Uh, I forgot who the first one is already. Uh, but Morgan, that's pretty cool. Have we got any other danglers in the pack? All right. And Hakimi. That's a dub. Magul, Morgan as well. We got Alex Morgan, Magul. But Hakimi, I think, is probably the most expensive card in that pack, to be fair, at 60k. Um, that's pretty good, I think. I don't know if Alex Morgan's worth anything. About 30k. Is Magul worth anything? about 6k but all in all that's about 100k worth of players right there i'll take that that's solid i am happy with that ea that is uh that is actually a pretty good pack that kind of saves us a little bit i can't lie that kind of saves us so we'll take that that's all right i almost forgot the other thing that you get from obviously doing some of these milestones is in moments you actually get 66 moment stars which will allow you to get yourself i think a tradable 50k pack with 60 stars, which is actually pretty good at this stage of the game, in my opinion, especially if you're running an RTG. So, who do we get in our tradable 50k pack? It's an Italian... Uh, it's... Right, whatever. Yep. Fun. Fun. Isaac. Yep. Cheers, EA. Wow, what a fun pack that is. I'm so glad I, I, I grinded for that. I, got, I actually got excited that I remembered that as well. Like, I remember that and I got really excited. Like, oh, of course. But no. Um, yeah, of course.
cool. Orlando's also completed the objectives on his account. I wanted to like test to see. Maybe my account just had bad pack luck. So we did it at the same time. Um, I'm hoping that he gets better pack luck than I did. Oh, Cancelo. That's a pretty good start. Cancelo's solid, man. 86 rated. He's not as expensive as he used to be in previous years, but he also is not as fast as he used to be. So swings and roundabouts. But Cancelo is not bad, actually. He's about 20, 30k. See, he's already better than me. You see, like maybe it is worth the grind. Maybe maybe it's worth the grind to, to some of you guys if you have better pack luck than I do, which is probably most of you. Um, all right, 100k pack now. Go on, let's get an icon. He has already packed Mad Ready Van Dyke as well. So, you know, pretty lucky. Pretty lucky red listed account, if you ask me. Lavelle? Who is this? I have absolutely no idea who this is. Katarina Mascario, 84. Sick. All right, fair enough. Maybe... I was waffling about the pack look thing. Uh, ooh, Werner and Ubmakano is good. Werner is actually worth like 15, 20k at the moment. Um, I don't know if Ubmakano is worth a huge amount. He should be worth a bit though. Yeah, at least 10k. That's solid. Gravenbursch in there as well. He's worth a little bit. Um, Jota's worth a teeny bit because of the uh, evolution as well. That's a solid 100k pack right there. 81 times 2. An 81 times 2 pack. Let's go. Belgian. Send him in. Don't be De Bruyne. Don't be a troll. <laughs> yes. Oh, my word. From an 81 times two. <laughs> Don't mind if I do, EA. Do not mind if I do. Oh, my word. <laughs> That's class, man. That is absolutely class. A cheeky, untradeable De Bruyne. I don't even know what objective that was from. I think that might have been for the list 50 objective. Oh, that's nuts, dude. De Bruyne in an 81 double upgrade. I've just packed Ruben Diaz right after as well from a two-player pack. That's crazy, dude. De Bruyne and then Ruben Diaz in back-to-back -back packs. Can I get Haaland next? Is Haaland too much to ask for, EA? Oh, my word, man. <laughs> De Bruyne and then Hubendish in back-to-back -back packs, boys. That's crazy. We also have Orlando's Nike Mad Ready packs. This is a bit of extra content. You guys are getting treated today, all right? You're getting, you're getting treated uh, with the content. We'll pick Enzo Fernandez because he is a Chelsea fan. 80-plus regal. Oh, okay. Check a little Mares. We'll take a walk out of the player pick. Our first walk out from a player pick this year. Now that is exhilarating. If that's not exhilarating content, and that doesn't deserve a like. I don't know what does. Um, all right. So there's obviously some not great packs here. We're just going to open the good packs. So we've got a couple 80, 80 times 2, 81 times 2s, and an 85 times 2. 80 times 2 first. Go on, be Haaland. It's not even Erdegaard, is it? It's sadly the centre mid. Um, and Ricardo Horta. Fair enough. All right. Here's what it is. Double 82 pack. It's not a double walkout, but it is a double 82 pack. All right, 281 times twos now as well. Let's see what the first one's going to be. It's going to be French, centre mid, Rabio. Oh, okay. It's Giori, I think. Not, or Borajo. It's Borajo. At least it wasn't Jensen because she's a massive troll. She's so annoying. Oh, every time I think I've got Haaland. All right, next one. Spanish, Cam, RB Leipzig, Danny Olmo, 83. These aren't going well, are they? Hopefully that 85 times 2 is what's going to bring us the luck. Fingers crossed. We'll discard Danny Omo. Come on. Give us a double walkout, EA. Please. Double walkout. Please, EA. Come on. We need a double walkout here. Italian. Centre mid. It's Verratti. It's going to be... Oh, it could be a double walkout. He's quite low rated. It is a double walkout, I think. I see a shadow behind the card. Who is going to be the second walkout? Because it is always higher rated. It's a woman. Oh, okay. Well, it is a double walkout at least. It, you know, it was a double walkout. But it's, it's sadly Verratti. He's not even on the game anymore. So we want compensation. And Sandra Panos. If you have enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you lads later.